1,200 metres to race. Last race of the afternoon, Gates crashed back in away in racing from the 1,200 metre mark. Bit of an untidy beginning, but Bierenberg and Goetz Lone have opted to switch off and they're going to race from the back end of the field early on. Towards the inside, All About Al broke out well as one of the early front runners. Pushing up forward is also Turbo Boost alongside Prince of Tibet and Lunch Money. Deep Proud is a strapment and deeper start on the track. We've got Counter Attack who's racing with Trippy Silk. Then back towards the inside grouping, we've got Suti with Mighty Mac, followed by just in behind that is Hudia. Question of Faith is racing down towards the inside rail. Bierenberg's next best and Goat Alone is racing last of all, with about eight lengths separating top to tail. As they make their way down towards the final 600 metres and Lunch Money is a Narrow leader over Winter Pearl. Down towards the insides, all about Owl. Deep route on the track. We've got counter attack and trippy salt with Mighty Mac. Then comes a Strathman who's smack bang down the centre of the track. We've got three lengths to make up as the race starts to unfold with 250 metres left to go. Winter Pearl has now picked up the running. Lunch Money's quick to challenge with Mighty Mac. Deep route on the track. We've got counter attack and go it alone. Who's unwinding a good looking round the outside. Strathman's with Winter Pearl. These two left to fight it out as Strathman now has his nose in front and as Strathman's going to come in to win it in the closing stages. Winter Pearl was Suti into that second and third place and then came Trippy Salt. Counter-attack was further back in the field followed by Lunch Money. Well, kudos to Brandon Bailey. The suit has done him justice. Number nine, a Strathman. Comes home to win in good fashion the last race of the afternoon. Good ride by Sean Veal. The race certainly started to unfold with the 400 metres left to run and got very close into the closing stages. But number nine, Estrathman, makes it back-to-back -back wins for the Pete Burtis stable and a top ride by Sean Veal. Second and third gets very close between Suti as well as Winter Pearl. We'll leave that one for the judge between number eight, Suti, as well as number three, Winter Pearl, for that second and third place. And then came number 12, Trippy Salt, who will run up in that fourth place, and only be some two lengths, followed by 11, Counter Attack. And then came Lunch Money, all about Old Go It Alone, was further back in the field, Prince of Tibet, Hudia, and the rest of the field were a long way back. They spread right across the track, but the winner, Estrapman, currently racing about four from the left-hand side in the red and yellow sleeves with the red cap. You can see Lunch Money is right there with Winter Pearl. These three are left to fight it out into the closing stages, but Estrapman will make a back-to-back -back wins here and now becomes a three-time winner from the 10 career starts. Top way to shoulder and certainly a gutsy win here in these conditions. Number nine, Estrapman for race number nine here at Hollywood Bets, Kenilworth Racecourse.